about your commute because times on the Kennedy Expressway are about to go up. WGN's Gator Hall has details on the upcoming construction project that will impact the reversible lanes and ramps. It is time for stage two of the rehab project on the Kennedy Expressway. And just like last year, IDOT officials say drivers need to gear up for major delays. I wasn't ready for it. Yeah, so it took me um, more time basically to get to my destination. The season of orange construction signs is almost upon us and getting an early start thanks to the fine weather. The next phase of the $150 million Kennedy project will shut down the reversible express lanes to rehab the access control system and bridge structures and patch the pavement. Uh, we're going to modernize the entire system so it's going to be more efficient to switch the lanes in, inbounds and outbounds when needed. Crews will also paint and install new lighting in both directions of Hubbard's Cave. The project started last year on the inbound Kennedy and will switch to outbound lane improvements next year. In the meantime, drivers will need to buckle up for more frustrating traffic, especially during the busy warm months. We are going out doing a major rehabilitation now, so we don't have to do a replacement, which would take a lot longer, be much more intrusive to the motoring public. IDOT officials encouraging drivers to use public transportation, plan alternate routes, and prepare for longer commutes. Um, so just pay attention, uh, slow down in the work zones, and it'll keep everybody safe. So weather permitting, the start date is Monday and construction on this phase of the project is expected to continue through the fall. Reporting along the Kennedy Expressway, Gaynor Hall, WGN News.